The hustle and bustle of Unguja. It's the largest of the three islands that make up Zanzibar and a magnet for tourists attracting over 150,000 visitors per year. But just northwest of this place is Tumbatu, and that's a different world. A 10-minute boat ride and I'm on the 7-kilometer long and 2-kilometer wide island. I arrive in time for the 4 p.m. prayers, residents heeding the call to pray a walk or cycle to the mosque. And it is because there are no motor vehicles here to speak of. Fatma Ali is 50 years old and has never seen a car. I have never been inside a car. I have never even seen a vehicle up close. I only see them on television. With no modern transport, residents here are forced to use alternative means. Businessmen hire porters to carry goods to their shops, whilst the elderly or sick are carried on stretchers to the island's only hospital. Since losing his leg to diabetes, this man hasn't left his house for treatment in 17 years. What's blocking us from having cars is the ocean. But if we had better roads here, people would find a way of getting cars across to here. We really would like to have them here, but we are unable to. The people of Tumbatu are very rooted in their traditions and customs. The island's elders are worried that outside influences could jeopardize their way of life. They are not very keen on links with the outside world. This is the only junction and the only road that connects the three parts of Tumbatu Island. Since the construction of this road 20 years ago, this road has not witnessed a single vehicle. However, the government here says that the island has had to give priority to more urgent matters. We can't ask why we don't have cars, when we had so many other important things that we didn't have. Tumbato didn't have water. Should we have focused on getting roads and cars when there was no water? That's not possible. Authorities say plans are underway to bring development to the island. But until then, the people of Tumbatu must make due with the little they have. Tulana Bohela, BBC, Tumbatu.